then guys, so for this area, what, what we're going to do now is we're going to grab ourselves some night vision again. We're going to make this area like an office area. So what we're going to do is just grab ourselves some spruce wood, spruce planks, stripped oak wood. Um, we need some things for desks. So we're going to grab ourselves some wood stairs, oak wood slabs, and it's still raining outside, which sucks. But that's fine. It makes, it makes Hawkins Lab even more creepy. And then this is going to be the office, so what we're going to do is make sure we've got enough room for a couple of toilets and a um, staff room. So use this space here. Okay, so going along like we would be normally. So this is going to be office. And then we can put a pillar in there. Oops, up three block that off and then this is what we're going to use just here so this area there use that space and then this build that up like so grab some more swiftness then this side is going to be kind of toilets just a couple of toilets here like that and then this side is going to be more toilets so you kind of come into a little corridor here toilet that way toilet that way make a door there we go and then we'll just fill this in mm, like so okay. so staff room next is going to be this entire area here so there'll probably be a little kitchen back here then a couple couches lava not lavatory <laughs> lavatories here not in the staff room not where you eat that would be a little bit disgusting so birch planks now we're going to grab a couple stick them like this in these little work areas over here upside down place like that that's perfect and there's going to be like a, a blocked up line like that and then on that line we're going to put a spruce slab blocking off these two two areas for workers to sit and do some do some business stuff Okay, and then we'll just stick that there, and then ups and downstairs stairs again, and then a stair in the gap. That's awesome, guys. You're doing good. Right. Once again, we'll stick another desk, maybe. Oh, no. Okay, we might stick another desk just about here. Or maybe in the door there. There we go. That was perfect. So this is a little bit tricky to make this one, so there we are. That's, that's much better. Upside down stairs, then that one there. Okay, like that, and like that. So I know these are quite packed together, but as you thought, you know, in an office it's quite packed anyway. A lot of people trying to work in the same sort of confined confined spaces gets a little bit stressful. And that's what we're kind of trying to recreate here. That sort of work environment in the office. After all, these people are trying to recruit people with superpowers, so they need a lot of not seats and things. There we are. And then over this wall, we'll do the same. So that goes around like that. Then we'll pull that off. And then same here. Yeah. So this one will be two only. And then this one will be three. This goes up two. That one goes up three. Then we're going to stick the birch slabs on top. Not birch, spruce, my bad. Going around the place like this. Upside down oak stairs. Oops, oh no, I'm breaking the wrong blocks. There we go. Upside down oak stairs like that. And like that. And lastly, but like that. Seat, seat, and seat. And this can just be like a corridor where there's a couple like coffee machines or something over this all. So there is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven people working in this one one little space here. That's perfect. And then over here, what we're going to do is make this an almost meeting area as well. So we can change this up to a little hallway. Oh no, my, my night vision. There we go. 
the meeting area will be on our how can we do this we can make the meeting area just here so let's plant the table two three one two three that's perfect it's not too big but not too small and then we can make this area over here the staff room so that goes up like that then there's two and then there's three <laughs> just notice that mistake there we go up like that this one's gonna be glass all the way around the top though like that and then glass we need to grab here switch out for the spruce then that wall can be filled up to there where there's gonna be the two birch doors for the meeting area so that's perfect and we don't actually need a staff room if this is gonna be kind of the meeting area should move this table out a little bit further now so that's good so it's not quite cramped into the wall there we are that's, that's much better and then change up the floor as well just grab myself some more swiftness and night vision did I grab the wrong potion yeah invisibility we don't need that one not today and we need some spruce there you are change up the flooring so it's not all wood it's supposed to be it's supposed to be quite a, a calm place at the, at the time that we've built this in at the moment the portal is contained there's nothing going bad with it at the moment Dr. Brenner's happy with the progress he's um he's just trying to recruit 11 right and then butch doors on them and then we can put the little kitchen area back there so we're going to use some dark oak for this going around like that two sinks we can also use these sinks for our lovely little bathrooms that we made as well. So we can put these in now too. Whilst we're here, we can grab ourselves some banners. We can use white banners for the towels. And then for the toilet itself, lock of iron, iron trap door, quartz stair, and a button. So iron. Oops, and that one goes after that. Like that. Now oh, we might just replace that block as well with a block of quartz underneath. Like so. So there you go. That's pretty good. Same on this side. Like that. So I know it doesn't look like there's much walking space. So we can change the sink up just here actually. Like this and get ourselves a tripwire hook. Stick that in there. Hmm. Oh yeah, that's a bit tricky, isn't it? Okay, we can keep this sink in the same spot. We just have to waste that little bit of space. Oh no, no. Genius idea. We can just turn the toilet around. Ah, oh, why didn't I think of that before? See what I mean, guys? A little bit of a noob here. Some senior moments going on. But it's fine. And then we might be able to place our banner behind that button. Please, please, please. No. Oh, that's perfect. A little one. A little a little towel rack. That'll be fine. So now we'll just do the same. Quickly. Like that. And then button. Awesome. Two toilets completed. Doors in either one. Birch doors. Glass block above. Just to let the rooms not smell too bad. Then we can grab ourselves some sea lanterns, stick these in the middle of them, stick it in the middle corridor. For this meeting area, we're going to come three away from the wall, fill them out of the way over, and then destroy these end ones just like that. And then we're going to fill it up with some upside down spruce wood through stairs like that and then we're going to grab ourselves some spruce wood slabs across and same with this area like I said this is for the workers it's supposed to be quite a nice looking place but they don't know the real secret the real truth of what's going on 
in Hawkins lab. It's quite it's quite gruesome. And then sea lanterns for this bit too. So downstairs. Like that. Now this bit gets a little bit tricky. What we're going to have to do is we're going to have to make this roof a little bit higher. So we're going to have to grab ourselves some polished andesite again. Like this. And go along. Up to there. Then we're going to grab ourselves some sea lanterns and some end stone bricks. Go along. The workers don't get much comfort. They, they're supposed to made to be worked hard, so we're going to make the lighting in a second. So we might just fill that in for a quick minute so we can actually figure out where the lighting is going to be. How we're going to make the pattern for the lighting in this room and for the hallway outside. So, if you guys have enjoyed this tutorial, by the way, please definitely drop a like, that'd be awesome. If you want to see more We The Sense tutorials and you're not already subscribed, definitely subscribe, that'd be awesome. We need to just fill this right up to this corner, that's perfect. And we're going to come three in from this one. No, don't run, off, don't run out of night vision now. Three in. Three in, two in from that one. Ah, it's not too dark, that's fine. So three in from this corner, then two up, and then that one, and then a sea lantern. Two up here, two up again. Perfect. Right now we can just decorate the desks and whatnot. So the desks might have a couple of flowers on, not in their workspace, but like a close by. Uh, we can switch up the flowers with different people, what they like, what they don't like. Maybe one of them likes a mushroom, who knows? So tulip in that one. Another di uh, dandelion in that one. Lily of the Valley in that one. Mushroom Man there. Blue Orchid in there. And then this one is going to have a orange tulip as well. Pretty cool stuff. And then the computers themselves are going to be a little bit old. So they're going to be like chorus flowers inside of item frames like this. So they all get the standard same computer. Hawkins Lab can't afford to pay out on some, some iMacs for these people, so it needs uh, some baseline stuff. Like that. And has everyone got... Yeah, everyone's got a keyboard, that's cool. And then you can stick some signs about the place if you want on their desks, just to make sure they've got like little notices. So you can put this one saying, um, Don't forget lunch. Takes a while to write, my bad guys. Don't forget, and then lunch. And just dot a couple of signs about basically on this block. Anywhere along these uh, these walls will be perfect. I'm going to put these next to the flowers because they look quite good. This one we're going to change up as well. Put um, happy birthday because it's this worker's birthday. like that that's perfect all right nice one and the meeting room will say like meeting in and then progress down here awesome now for the meeting room what we're going to do same similar thing i did in my mansion tutorials actually just some bookshelves around the place on that wall just there because that is the only wall without a window so across like that no not across not across my bad uh, what we will do though is stick a slab going like that just so a little shelf in there and then this corner we're going to have a cactus plant what you need is a plant pot a cactus and an oak some oak leaves two little shrubs basically in the corners like that sweet and then we might put a clock on the wall back there with an item frame as well where is the clocks gone the clocks have vanished oh you guys are probably watching this again wheel assassin they're right there mate but i'm just too blind to see them where have they gone oh no that's compass there they are there they are of course they're here 
on that polished andesite block just there. Sorted. And then here we're going to grab... Maybe there's one of them that wants to cook something. They don't have an oven, but they do have a lovely microwave for you to use. So I'm just going to stick a glass block with a door handle there for the microwave. And then we'll put a trap door on top of there. One microwave right there, guys. Amazing. And then corn flour in this corner. And a little preparation area just there with maybe like a tools rack for spatulas and whatnot as well. All right, and this space can just be filled up with a little seat for anyone who's going for a meeting. Um, like so. Perfect. And then the toilet area, we can just stick an upside down stair just there. One there, one there, like a little pillar. But you could even just block that out and stick yourself another plant in there. But this one's dead. Because it's not too many bad fumes. There we go. <laughs> okay. That is pretty much it, guys. Over here, we might just stick a couple of coat hangers, though. For the workers to put their coats up on the racks. Like that. And that is it. That is basically the first floor of Hawkins Lab completed. Thank you so much for watching this video as a tutorial, guys. I really hope you've enjoyed it. If you would like to see part 2, please definitely drop a like below and we will probably just build part 2 with more meeting areas and a staircase going up to the roof. But if you don't, it's absolutely fine. We, we could probably just fill this in somehow with uh, with some different rooms. So, like I said, this, it's hard to build what is it actually in this place. I know there's quite a lot of like prison cells, that sort of thing. And because um, this place is supposed to represent like a Cold War sort of base where they're trying out new future tech for future wars and things which is kind of cool. but anyway thank you so much for watching this video so tutorial i really hope you've enjoyed it if you have definitely smash that like button that'd be awesome thank you so much for sticking around i really appreciate it i know it's such a long tutorial even just decorating the first floor of hawkins lab but if you guys want to request part two uh floor two sorry definitely do that in the comments below if you want uh just let me know what sort of rooms you want me to add but thank you so much once again guys definitely subscribe if you want to see more tutorials and i will see you at the next wheel assassin video have a good one. Peace out.